Japan's Liberal Democrat Party, which was all but destroyed at the polls only three years ago after running Japan for most of the post-war period, has stormed back to power. Former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe will now take the Conservative Party down a road he's advocated for years, but is only now in a position to take. People have been demanding the recovery of Japan's economy, with many hoping for a pay rise. There are also many young people who are concerned about future employment prospects. I therefore think the most important mission to begin with is to focus on economic recovery. Defeated Prime Minister Yoshihiko Noda's Democratic Party of Japan may only win 65 seats in the 480-member lower house of parliament. He has already stepped down as party leader. Abe has promised a more assertive foreign policy, especially with China, continuing with nuclear power and massive public spending and monetary easing to end deflation, boost the economy and drive down the yen. Along with its Komito allies, the Liberal Democratic Party could obtain a two-thirds majority, which would end the upper house's blocking of bills that has paralyzed policy in Japan since 2007.